Oh, hey everybody, it's the Musical Gamer again. Welcome back to Let's Play Art and Elico 2, the melody of Metaphalica. I'm just enjoying this funky beat here in Mint Block. But we have a mission today. We need to go to the Mikri Forest, to the Coal Lodge, and meet up with Legolius. Which was our mission to begin with, because we need to make sure that Lady Cloche is, well, relatively safe. Because Lord knows what the hell will happen if the Sacred Army gets their grimy mitts on her. So, let's go. All the way over here, where we were before, is where the Coal Lodge is. And luckily for us... We have a save point here. Um, I pretty much recently saved though, so I'm not gonna bother using it again. Up ahead, the Coal Lodge. Alright then. What do we- Ah, there he is! Captain! Captain Leglius! I'm glad you're safe. You're late. I got tired of waiting. Sorry. Lady Cloche, I'm relieved to see you're safe as well. Yes, you too. Lady Cloche? What's wrong? You don't seem too well. No, I'm fine. So what is the situation? Not good. I've heard some bad rumors, too. Rumors? Rumors like what? And just how are they bad? Let me guess. They were about the true heir to the Imperial Throne. Exactly. As you know, the Pope was the previous ruler of this land. Chancellor Alfman was just a magistrate back then. It seems the Conservative Party, the Sacred Army, found their new leader. Who would be the true heir to the Imperial Throne? That's right. They say it's the Pope's grandchild. They found the royal heir, so they've begun to take action. That's what triggered the attack on Lady Gloche. <sighs> Figures. But that's not the end of it. There's more to these disturbing rumors. Supposedly, the Sacred Army has the Goddess's power on their side. What? That's right. She who holds absolute authority over this world and... The deity who we declared war against. Yeah, that was a bad move. Yeah, no, no kidding. Uh, I don't know when declaring war on a superior and supreme being is ever a good idea. It doesn't matter who you are, forcibly suppressing people is bad, I think. B but that's just my opinion. Your regime was born from under the suppressive force of the goddess. But if you do the same thing, the people will be unhappy again. Quiet, you. Do not speak about politics that you can't possibly understand. B but I was worried, so I thought I should say something. You needn't worry. We have plans for anything that could possibly happen. Whew, forgive me. It was stupid for me to butt into your conversation. But I still think the way you said that was mean. Listen here. This is an emergency. I can't listen to everyone's opinions. <gasps> What's with the gasp? Lady Cloche, what 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 just happened? Please be alright. What what's going on? Oh no. Is she her life extending agent? Ah, she must be a third generation Ravetail. We know this because of the first game. Orica was one of those. She needed to take a life extending agent. That's right. She's a Ravetail. She can't live that long without the agent, yes. Third generation Ravetails have um, unusually short lifespans, unless they take this life-extending agent. They usually... We Rivertails die unless we take the agent every three months. I, that's not entirely true, but, um, I think once you get... Because third-generation Rivertails, I think, have a life expectancy of, like, 15 years or something. Unless they take this agent. Um, oh god, I'm the one who has to give it to her? It's an emergency. The Guardian Knight must take responsibility. Uh, is, is it really prudent for us to be doing that right now? 
You ever administered it? No, I don't think I have. Did it sound like I even knew it existed two minutes ago? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we need to insert this Diquility Crystal into our installer port. Make a crystal this big. The insertion process is always painful. Oi. 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 Damn it, game. God damn it, game. You're awake now? I've been awake. I didn't think you would end up doing this to me, too. You can choose someone else to do this if you want. Your mission is to protect me. That would be dereliction of duty. You have to give it to her. We'll give you some privacy. As Luca begrudgingly leaves and Leglius gladly leaves. If you hurt me, I'll never forgive you. Oi. God damn it, Gust. Lady Cloche? Oh. Um. Sure. We'll do our best. I can't even say it. I can't even speak the dialogue. Oy vey. You've... This game, I swear to God... <laughs> You're out of the nights. Ain't <laughs> that some gratitude? <laughs> and Luca goes running off. Well then... Eh, oh, what the hell? Coconut. Coconut, what's wrong? Nothing, I'm fine. I just felt so tired all of a sudden. Well, it was a long trip. Huh? What's wrong with you? Oh, um, you were missing, so I got worried and came looking for you. Oh, I'm sorry I made you worry. I'm glad we found you. I heard stories from Crow, but you really are nice. Huh? Uh, thanks. There you are. Don't wander off. There are monsters in the area. Let's go back. Oh, yes, sir. Sorry. Hokona, can you walk? Yep, I'm okay. God, even even Kokona's showing signs of fatigue, and what the hell is going on here? Damn, looks like we were took too long. Leglius, I didn't think the Knight Captain would be here of all places. What a shame. I guess we have to defeat you all. So, what are you after? Why are you after Lady Cloche anyway? Because she will bring damnation upon this world. Damnation? How rude! Do you speak knowing I am Cloche Lethal Pastalia, descendant of the Maidens? You aren't the legitimate descendant of the Maidens. You're the Maiden of Damnation. We will purge you here and now. Oh, joy. Okay. If that's how it's going to be, that's how it's going to be. We'll take the fight to you. Uh, I think it's only appropriate if Cloche is the one to be singing the song here. Let's just attack. And now we must defend. Excellent. Some good def- Uh, ooh, okay. Whew. Uh, come on. Can I get the... Oh, I got the psych... I got the psych fill, too. Uh-oh. Uh, ow. I'm sure it does, Luca. Why don't you just... There you go. Destroy the raven tail. Okay, good. That was quick. Wow, that was awesome. Uh, two tranquilities, song stones, kettle rice, igniting water. Eh, all in all, some decent drops. Game does give you good drops on enemies. Wh wait, there's like a lot of them now. Damn it, reinforcements. Crap, this isn't Pistalia in the Grand Bell Hall. This is their home. Shut up and surrender. Never! I will protect Lady Cloche no matter what happens. Have it your way. Hey! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Start singing and get this over with! 
Oh, nuts. That's too many of them. We gotta run. Alone it might be possible, but it won't work for us this time. Oh, no. Uh. What the? What is this? I'll tell you what it is. It's a deus ex machina. That's what it is. Well, sort of. There is a reason. But it's kind of deus ex machina-like right now. Luca! Get a hold of yourself! Huh? I'm okay. I just feel a little dizzy. What did you do? That was amazing! I don't know. I thought we were going to die, so I got really scared. We better get moving before reinforcements show up. Then let's go back to Luca's house. Fine. I suppose we will do that. Eh, who the hell are you? There you are, finally. I, you, this is the third time we've seen you, and we still have absolutely no clue who you are or why you keep following us. Damn it, game. I don't like loose ends. Where the hell is this? Oh, this guy. That's why I kept telling you we need to hurry. At this rate, the world belonged to the goddess. Isn't that right, Jackley? Ooh, that's some ominous foreshadowing right there. Chancellor Alfman, more pieces of the world fell. Parts of the Bell area, West Dreamy Fields, and Southeast Enna collapsed. That aside, what is the situation with the Sacred Army? Are they gone now? But this is important! The Goddess is steadily destroying the world. 400 years ago, she destroyed in Velpira, and hope for the entire world. And now that we declared war, she wants to wipe the world clean. We must hurry. We must destroy the goddess as soon as possible. And annihilate the sacred army. Their eradication must be made our top priority. But Chancellor! Listen closely, loud. We will be fighting a goddess. A supreme being. Do you know who your greatest enemy may be in war? Your own ally. There are too many cases where an ally betrayal has caused the loss of a war. Well, he does have kind of a point. The first thing we must do is unite the world. Gather all minds as one and challenge her. That is our only way to victory. That is why I have Cloche speak for us. Her devotion is contagious. Look, the world is surely coming together. The Grand Bell degraded the people, the morale and the growth. We, the Neo Grand Bell, shall revitalize this rotten Metafals. Yes, for the glorious Metafals, the true utopia of the world. Oh boy. Great, it's our boss. And he's a little bit cuckoo. Legolas has joined the group. Probably won't be using him, however. He's not right now. He's level six. Uh, he actually probably works well with. Uh, who does he work well with? Hang on. Does he work well with Cloche? Yes, he does work well with Cloche. So I could interchange um, him and Coconut if I wanted to, but I like Coconut. Coconut's a cool character. You'll learn to really love Coconut. Trust me on that. You'll really learn to love Coconut. Eh. What the hell is that thing? And can we eat it? What's that? A monster? Looks like a marshmallow more than anything. Someone's it. Oh, it's you! 
Uh, are you okay? Uh, uh, hey, come on. I don't have all day. Uh, hungry. What? What? Wow, that was delicious. Thanks a bunch. Are you all right now? <sighs> she ate all our emergency rations. Why were you lying here? Oh, I traveled for three days without food or water, and then I passed out. What is that thing? Hmm. What is your name? Ah, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Omri, and this is Soup. He's not really useful, but he makes a great pillow. Soup? Is he edible? I'm sorry. He's kind of cute. Really cute? I've never seen an animal like this. Neither have I. <laughs> Isn't he? We've been traveling together for a while now. Anyway, I'm glad you're okay. Just be sure to pack enough food next time. Well then... Uh, hey, wait! Uh, what is it? Ooh, can you take me with you? I'm really good at archery and stuff. Uh... Weren't you traveling somewhere? Yeah, seriously, weren't you going somewhere? Oh, um, well... Huh? Ugh, fine, I confess. I don't have anywhere to stay tonight, and I have no money. <laughs> <laughs> so you're just a, you're just a freeloader and a bum. Uh, are you sure about that, Luca? Well, I don't think we can legally stop you. It is your home, after all. <laughs> Good. So, do you want to stay at my place? Really? You saved my life! Thanks! Oh, um, Luca, was it? You're my new Oh, jeez. Um, okay. Little... Little too friendly for my liking. Hey, you're my savior. Just, a, just a tad. I'll do my best to help you out, okay, Luca? I remember when we used to have standards. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when we used to have standards. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, Amory has joined our group, and so has the strange and en enigmatic floating. Puffball marshmallow that is soup. Next time on Let's Play Artinelico 2, we'll be returning to Luca's house once more. With the new party member in tow. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. See you guys next video.